What's up, loves? What's up, divas and divos? It's your girl. You guys already know that. So you guys are also already know I don't really do too many update videos. Like, I will just keep it pushing. Like, seriously, I'll just keep it pushing, okay? But some hair I do like, and I do just keep around on my mannequin heads. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I do be having my favorites. Um, And yes, you see my shirt. Hey, babe. So this is to you guys. Hey, babe. So in case you guys are wondering, I got this from Forever 21. One. That's one of my favorite stores in the world next to, um, I don't even know because I got like a bunch of favorite stores, uh, Dollar Tree, but you can't buy no clothes from there. Uh, I don't even know. Okay. But I love, um, I love freaking Forever 21 because you could get like the cutest cheap stuff like seriously and they have my size so I love it I loves it but anyway so back to this wig that I got on so first of all like I was saying this is gonna be like a really informal video because like I said I don't really do too many update videos and what's so crazy is I was I was in a rush to leave this morning because I thought I had to go to court so I was like, I'm going to put this hair on um, and I'm going to just put it on real quick because it looked really cute with my outfit and I'm going to run out the door. And when I went downstairs to look through my paperwork to get the directions, it wasn't today. It was next week. So, yeah. So I figured, why not do my update on this? So you guys know I love curly hair. I love wavy hair. I love anything that's easy, honey. It's easy, easy, easy. So I actually did the initial video in June for this hair. June 5th. And this is, of course... <sighs> from one of my favorite websites in the whole wide world, omgherhair.com. And this is their 360 lace wig, okay? Now, um, I'm just looking to see what the density is because, you know, I can't really remember everything. It is 180% density, it's pre-plucked hairline, and it is virgin Brazilian human hair. So as you can see, I know you can't, but Listen, I don't really have to do much when I put this wig on, but just put it on, which is amazing. I don't have to put any concealer there. I don't have to really, like, finagle the lace because it just, like, melts right in your skin, which is really, really great, and I love that about it. And I was going to wear it up today because it's just so blazing hot outside. But now... The wig is absolutely gorgeous, okay? I love it. I've worn it several times, um, and she sits right on my mannequin head. Really easy to wash. I just let it air dry on one of my mannequin heads. Um, it did tangle, not excuse me, it did tangle a little bit in the nape area. All of my wigs tangle in the ape nape area, um, and that's just because it rubs against my neck, it rubs against my clothing, it rubs against the furniture. I think everybody's wigs tangle in the nape area, like definitely in the nape area. Some some worse than others this one was not too bad as for shedding it did shed a little bit um and like i said it it definitely shed when i was combing the nape area out so my biggest suggestion to you guys when you're detangling your wigs in the nape area because that's when it gets really tangled and if you just take it off and don't finger comb it or don't comb it with a wide tooth comb and you just leave it and just put it back on it's going to get really bad and it's going to start getting really ratty so you want to make sure that you're detangling them every time you take them off so what i always use when i'm detangling any wigs is one of these this is the one that i've used i've had this comb for like ever so i wouldn't even begin to tell you where i got it from i've had it for a very long time but i would highly suggest trying to find something that the teeth or really wide like this this is the best thing you don't have to use like detangling sprays I know a lot of places you'll see wig detangling sprays for synthetic or human hair let me tell y'all something you don't even need to buy that stuff because it's just a bunch of chemicals that will build up in the hair over time and for me honestly in my opinion I really think that it makes it a million times worse because it just starts building up because trust me I've used those what I use is I get a little spray bottle a little spritz bottle and I put a tiny bit of conditioner in there and some warm water more water a bunch of warm water more than condition I shake it up and then I spritz that on the area of the tangling and I just wide tooth comb it if you don't have a wide tooth comb maybe you'll have like a brush like this you want to be gentle if you don't have either 
definitely these always work I'm pretty sure you got these which are your fingers you can always use your fingers to detangle it you want to be gentle about it because if you're raking through it that's when you're gonna have excessive shedding you're gonna start breaking the hair off so a lot of times people think that it's shedding it's shedding well it's really not shedding it's just excessive combing and you're just putting excessive strain on the wig so that's why I say get yourself like some warm water and some conditioner and just spray in that tangled area and get yourself a really good wide tooth comb or brush and go ahead and use your fingers so now, that was the one thing that I've had with the, the wig was just the tangling in the nape area and like I said all of them get like that as for the most part it's a really low luster I like the fullness of it I love a wig I don't really care if it's a 360 or a, a, a full lace or lace front let me tell you i will wear them all the same and post them up in a ponytail or what have you it's all good it's all really good but i do like omg her hairs pre-plugged hairlines because they just like melt in your scalp so that's the one thing that i do like about them plus they always got like um some type of coupon codes or something like that that's going on or a sale and then they also have different units that are very affordable versus some that are not um that are not as cheaply priced but either way the hair is virgin so if you want to go ahead and put some box dye to it or you want to bleach it process it whatever you want to do you can definitely do that with this hair me personally I just like it in its natural state because I could just put it on and go and so that's basically what I've been doing to it so definitely you can check them out like I said I've been wearing this since June off and on I did like the fullness of this trust me a girl like density like I like my hair to be full not dense up in the front because um that's just not gonna work for a girl but you know what I'm saying like if it's full then girl we good and I just love it when I could just put it on and go and be out the door honeys okay so like for today I just got it clipped up here and got me some little baby hairs going and I feel like the look is really cute. So, hey, babe. So, on that note, definitely check out OMG Her Hair. I will post all of their links below for you guys, along with their YouTube channels, their social media channels, and any coupon codes that I have below. You will also get those. And as always, stay diva and divalicious. Make sure you rate, comment, subscribe. I love you guys. And I will see you in a soon to come video. Make sure you thumbs it up because you know you love me. And I love you guys.